22 News at 11. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lauren Maloney. Well, the capital city has been living under a mask mandate for indoor spaces for nearly a year now. The city council imposed it last June, nearly two full months before the state did the same. But now an end for Montpelier's mask mandate is in sight. Local 22's Mike Cowie joins us now live from the newsroom with all the details. Mike. Well, Lauren, the city council has voted to lift the mask mandate effective June 15th, unless Governor Phil Scott ends Vermont's state of emergency first. The Montpelier city manager's office has been getting lots of questions recently about whether the capital city's mask mandate is still in place. We did reach out to other localities that have put mandates in place. Um, most of them are still in place and will remain in place, they told me, until the governor's state of emergency is rescinded. Tuesday night, the South Burlington City Council revoked their mask mandate in favor of the more lenient state guidance. But that same night, Virgens voted to leave their mandate in place. Burlington has tabled any measures to lift theirs until at least June 7th. Montpelier Councilor Connor Casey said that if you follow the science in starting a mask mandate, you need to do the same if the science suggests ending it. I don't know if you pick the date like June 15th, is there anything we're going to learn between now and June 15th that is going to sway our opinion one way or the other? I don't really think so. Capital City resident Phyllis Rubenstein doesn't like the idea of choosing a date like June 15th because of Memorial Day weekend. I think it would be much better to see what happens after this major travel event, people coming to Vermont, people leaving the state and returning. Councillor Jay Erickson spoke of a desire to not allow Montpelier to go too far out of step with what the state is doing. Just what I read today is, you know, this morning is that they're, you know, the governor's hoping there's a chance that we'll get to 80% by Memorial Day as opposed to the 4th of July. In which case the state of emergency will be lifted and all local mask mandates will go away. Now, Lauren, the council does have one more meeting before June 15th. It's two weeks from tonight on the 9th. So if any new developments with the virus arise between now and then, they can revisit the mask mandate issue at that time. Live in the newsroom, Mike Coey, Local 22 News. Mike, Queen City Mayor Moreau Weinberger.